Coffee Farm Guy here, and this is Coffee Production by Dogface on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this, uh, well, production. Uh, seven, uh, 13.71 megabytes to download, 26, 13, and this is, I believe, it's 23 slots on console or there very close to, but it's the cutest cell point I have ever, ever seen. It's the Corgi Cafe. <laughs> With a drive through and a menu, a very nice menu. Yes, and they're hiring. I'm thinking of applying if I get to work with corgis all day. Oh, darn. Um, so cell point uh, goes here at the uh, loading dock. Uh, so we started with the cell point because it's just so darn cute. Um, production and cell points. And there it is. The Corgi Cafe. $55,000 to put down to place. Um, so, uh, what has happened here? Well, I uh, I forgot to turn my void, uh, uh, mic on for the first part of the video. So, we have uh, we have the end result here of what I have done, but that's okay. So, we got a greenhouse and a factory. The greenhouse is going to be under productions and greenhouses. There it is, ten thousand dollars to place. Water and fertilizer, liquid fertilizer go in, coffee comes out. Very nice, simple recipe there. We're going to look at that in more detail. And the coffee production, the ro the roastery, coffee roaster factory here, $80,000. Uh, diesel and raw beans go in, roasted coffee beans come out. So... As you notice, uh, I have had this factory running already. This is kind of neat. The roaster going in like so. That's cool. So let's have a look at them in, uh, in the coffee bean, uh, raw coffee bean. I do believe uh, water is 200,000. Yes, 200,000 liters of water, 20,000 liters of liquid fertilizer. Um, I believe, but we're going to fill, let's, uh, let's, oh, that's diesel. Where's my, where's my other liquid tank? My tank of liquid gold. There it is. Right. I will tell you right away. It's, a. Uh, it's even quantities equal to the, um, so here's what, okay. We got water here. We should top up. So before I do this. This is how much they've gone in in one month. So the greenhouse has produced 51,000 liters. The coffee rotisser, roast, roaster, roastery, coffee roaster factory, not so fast on the draw. 17,000 liters a month. Uh, it's a bit disappointing to be quite honest. Uh, here is the trigger, water going in. So this is what looks like the roasted coffee coming out. Uh, unfortunately, that's not the only disappointment. Uh, here's the raw coffee beans. Yes, they're red because that's uh, that's what they look like when they come off the plant. Uh, they're actually red. Uh, there's a cover on them. Right, so... Uh, do, 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 okay, 30,000 liters of, of water and fertilizer how much fertilizer again oh man well I'm dealing with that let's uh, look at the roast uh, coffee roast or er, place uh, 500,000 liters of raw beans and 25,000 liters of diesel is the capacity there but that's gonna take a very long time to run out of that and we're just gonna throw some liquid fertilizer in this tank and give you a, uh, a an accurate Make sure I picked liquid fertilizer. There we go. It shouldn't, it shan't take too much because um, it doesn't take that much. There we go. So, uh, there we go. <laughs> 20, uh, 30,000, yes, there we go. That's what it was. 30,000 liters of water 
and 3,000 liters of liquid fertilizer and it uh, it does quite well it produces quite a lot actually right so why the disappointment with the, aside from the slow production rate which you would think roasting coffee would take a lot less time than growing coffee they must have them mixed up I don't know but seems a bit odd uh, product that product goes in here so if we got uh, diesel for instance uh, very generous uh, input there we go diesel in there very nice if you don't want to deal with pallets uh, just set the greenhouse to distribute and it will send them directly over to the um, the factory now we're going to grab a pallet of beans raw beans and we're going to input them into the factory now the problem here obviously is you're going to produce way more i guess maybe that's why the um um the input size of the uh the fact this factory has such a large input and there we go coffee beans going in voila just like so now let's pick up a uh, roasted some roasted beans right okay very good it's it's quite heavy you can sell it directly or you can take it over to the coffee shop and we're going to get how much? 5,548 dollars for roasted a thousand liters of roasted beans. So eh, yeah, that's okay. It's it's all right. It's not fantastic or anything like that. It's not I'm on easy economy, remember. So let's just for curiosity's sake take some raw not we're not going to roast it we're just going to take some raw coffee beans and we're going to sell it at the sell anything from schultz modding and what do we got ten thousand four hundred and twelve dollars you see a problem here <laughs> i certainly see a problem here and the problem is you can sell the raw beans for twice as much as you can sell the roasted beans now is this yeah that's somebody's got their wires crossed here but that's just what i found out on this map on easy economy uh, it just doesn't make sense why would you take beans that you can sell for ten thousand dollars per thousand liters and roast them and now you get five thousand dollars per thousand liters it doesn't make sense i think something is broken unfortunately it's gonna have to be labeled needs an update because who would do that but anyways um there you have it that's the coffee production by dogface on farming simulator 22 thank you all for watching i'm looney farm guy and remember it's only a game so till next time Bye for now.